Batman Beyond as a reboot for the Batman franchise. Holy shit. I'd love that. Hey, what's going on, guys? My name is Movie Driven, and welcome to another News Talk episode. Today, we're going to talk about the reboot, the unknown reboot Batman franchise that everyone keeps talking about. Uh, even Warren Brothers is trying to figure this out. But I think they kind of figured it out. Question is, is this confirmed? Will Batman Beyond be the new series of Batman? We have Christopher Nolan, the Dark Knight series, but it's not the original series. That franchise is over. Like, the series is over. He's not going to be directing another fourth Batman movie. Christopher Nolan's Batman version is not going to be in Justice League. That's what they said at least, but they can always change their minds. But I think there's going to be a confirmed movie about Batman Beyond. And if you don't know what Batman Beyond is, Batman Beyond is basically the future version of Batman. But it's not going to be Bruce Wayne playing Batman then. It's going to be a different character. He's going to be a teenager. And his name is Terry McGinnis. I used to watch Batman Beyond when I was out, when I was a kid. I liked the series. I really did like it. That's when I really got my love for Batman. But I got even more love when the Dark Knight movies came out. Because I understood Batman more. Now, Batman is my favorite character of the entire Justice League member. First it was Superman, now it's Batman. I don't know how this is gonna be connected to Justice League. I don't know how this is gonna be connected to Man of Steel, but Warren Brothers is also saying that Christian Bale playing as Bruce Wayne in Batman Beyond could possibly happen. The mentor for Terry could be Bruce Wayne. So if there's going to be a new Batman, if there's going to be a future version of Batman, then where's Bruce Wayne, is he dead? No, Bruce Wayne is just older. He's an old guy now. And he is serving Terry as his mentor, his sensei, his coach, his trainer, I guess. Batman Beyond contains some new villains and it also contains some old villains as well. I'm going to spoil the end of The Dark Knight Rises. So if you have not seen The Dark Knight Rises, just click out of the video. Take care. Leave your comments. Bye-bye. But if you have seen the movie, here's what happens. The ending of the movie, Jason Gordon-Levitt becomes Robin. But Warm Brothers may change that instead of it being Robin it could be the suit for his future, like Batman Beyond, that he's the new Batman. That could happen. They could always change that. But, of course, everything is going to have to be depending on Christopher Nolan. The Batman universe for Christopher Nolan is over. So if they want to develop it even more, I'm not really sure if that's going to happen. But there's a rumor going on about that. And there is possibility that Joseph Gordon-Levitt might be playing the new Batman, whether it's going to be playing as Robin in the Batman, or maybe he's going to be playing the new Batman. We don't really know. Warren Brothers still have problems connecting the, the new franchise of Batman with Justice League, and I'm very curious to see how they're going to do that. But the untitled Batman reboot will be hitting theaters two years from now in 2015, so be excited for that. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. Leave me your comments down below and tell me, would you guys be interested to see a Batman Beyond? Yes or no? Anyways, guys, that's it for me. Take care.